we'll do the regular. Okay. We're gonna play How Well Do You Know Your Co-Star. Three, two, one. Hi, Hi we're the Fab three, three from, from Netflix's, Netflix's Queer Eye. Boys, you ready? This is Tan. This is Anthony. I'm Jonathan, <laughs> and I don't do units and lines. I think you're not gonna be very good at this. Okay, <laughs> I think Tan's about to be proven wrong this morning. <laughs> Go ahead, Tanny. Let's let's take your quiz first then. I grew up helping my grandparents' business every summer. What was their business? A bakery that made meat pies, a shoe repair shop, a factory that made denim for Disney, or a millinery? Four. Okay. Oh my gosh, it wasn't the meat pies. I've heard something like that before. Okay. But shoe, shoe. The shoe. Uh, I always knew that you two were so f***ing self-absorbed because you got it wrong. Part was I've like, no. I've it a thousand okay. times to you. You never yes, I heard. I heard the denim part, but I said no to Disney because I thought you guys were trying to trick us because you went to Disney recently, so it was like two different things That's together. That's why I went to Disney. And I have Ugh. told you the story a couple of times. Did you know earlier when you said I tell the same story every, every now and then again? It's because I know you didn't listen the first two or three times. How are you really going to come up here on MarieClaire.com? Uh-huh. And call me out on not knowing your family made jeans, yet I had to buy these. How come I don't have any? <laughs> and if you listen to the rest of my story, uh, uh, they sold it 20 years ago. Oh, right. It's good that we don't hold resentments. <laughs> now mine. What is the first credit listed on my IMDb page? A. <laughs> the Diary, a short film about an American moving to Montreal. B. A production assistant on Anne of Green Gables. C, waiter number two on the house bunny. Oh, that sounds about right. No, D, myself on the Canadian version of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. It's A, it's going I to be I think it's a. the house bunny. Uh, There's no way it's the house bunny. I wanted bunny. to be house I bunny. Wanted to be the house bunny. You're, you're right, you're right, you're right. Okay. It's the diary. Oh no! Oh. We come see it, please can you bring it to us? I can't, I need to see it. Oh, I was a chubby baby. So this is before the pressure of a lot the of quesadillas, a lot of pressure from TV. What is my dad's middle name? Is Shut up! <laughs> Oldroyd. No. <laughs> Elroy. Oldroyd. 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 <laughs> 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 name is that? That's Rob's name. His husband. That's husband. Husband. my husband's Which, middle name. Honey, I mean Oldroyd. <laughs> Come on, it's like you leave him alone. Uh, when I was 17, I told my parents I was going to go to a I friend's house in Leeds for a week. Where did I go instead? A, my boyfriend's house in Leeds, B, Paris, oh. C, Mallorca, or D, New York. It was, um, oh, 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 I have heard this story, but sometimes I feel like I can't remember if it was Paris or New York, but I actually think it was Paris, so I'm gonna say Paris. Uh, I'm for sure it's New York. I knew you loved me more. Whatever, I heard the story before, you're a nightmare. <laughs> this stupid <laughs> game like completely lends itself to like your nice personality, how like it listens, it's more like cooperative, it's more thoughtful. I'm obviously like a bad friend and a He's bad a terrible person. terrible friend. Who only talks about themselves and nausea, I mean, so obviously you're gonna know all of these answers. And I just think <laughs> yep. that's great. <laughs> Which of these is not a language I speak? <laughs> Polish, English, Spanish, or French? Spanish, you don't speak Spanish. Yeah. I can get around. You don't not speak as good Spanish. As not as good as the other three. I contributed to MTV's I Love the Blank series. What decade did I love? The, oh. the 20s, the 70s, the 90s, or the 2000s? Not the 20s. He's not a flapper deco. Oh, I'm not? He I would say the 90s. 90s reference. Yeah, I'm so good you know me so well. 70s. It was 2000. Oh, screw you. Uh, okay. off. What is my hometown of Doncaster United Kingdom famous for? A, clotted cream. B, horse racing, C, steam trains, or D, tea kettle. Now, in all fairness, I do You never know. told us this. I didn't know the answers on this. If it's <laughs> clotted cream, I'm gonna be so happy because it explains your love for sweets. Yeah. Okay. Based off of your initial reaction to right when he said clotted cream, I feel like it's clotted cream. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh. Devonshire's known for clotted cream. That's where clotted cream comes from. Oh. It's for two things. Food, food and wine expert right <laughs> over know. here. Horse racing or steam trains? Who knew? I don't know. Well, that's the only questions I get. I only had three. Yeah, we could have done 30 and you wouldn't have gotten any. When I was young, mm -hmm. I would iron decals from what musical group on my sweatshirt. I love you so much. I know. Metallica. Just the fact that this is a thing I that know. you did. Metallica, Backstreet Boys, Hanson, Salt and Pepper. We're getting rid of Metallica. Yeah, definitely not Metallica. I don't think it was Salt and Pepper. Sultan, no, Sultan I, I feel like right. he was more think, of a white. I don't think pop. it was Backstreet Boys at all. Hans? I think maybe Hanson. 
was right. I was obsessed with the answer. Hey, go us. We know the best problem. The solvers. Yeah, but you know what? This is the thing about Hanson. I was very, I was not your normal Hanson fan, honey, because you know I had it out for more than anyone. I did not have time for Tay, and that Zach was too young for me. But that Isaac, honey, that Isaac, honey, was he, which, what, which that one older, was he? goofy looking one, honey, I loved his like oh. skinny ponytail side part, mm. having ass oh, in the '90s, yeah. honey. I was like, you better bop right over here and hold me in this Midwestern town. I'm so alone. <laughs> All my bedroom was everything Hanson posters everywhere. And then my only girlfriend that I ever had, her name was Bree. She came to my house and she went into my bedroom and she was like, <laughs> I know we should never make fun of bullying. We should never make fun of bullying. I don't think you were picked it at school for being gay. I think you were picked it at school for that. The in general. It could have been my interpretive, like lyrical dance that I did in the talent show too. That too. It was to a Jewel song. And which one? Um, it was the last track on the album with hands. I don't know who she is. Jewel. I don't think that was a thing. Who say if you so? These foolish games are. Tearing me, tearing me, you're tearing me apart And your thoughtless words are breaking my heart Thanks for watching How Old Do You Know Your Castmates with uh, us from Netflix's Queer Eye. Watch season two streaming now.